foundation on already. This is the foundation I used. And I'm just going to apply a little bit more blush on. The blush color I'm going to be using today is on a mission. Go in with a slanted brush, tap it lightly, and then just tap it. It's a gray smoky eye like this. I do like to use pinks for the lipstick. So the color I want to choose from is going to be the Viva Glam Gaga. It's a luster, so it's a nice cream color. actually is in their new collection, Tartan, but I have this for a while now. Or like a light pink and a light pink lip. That's what I basically recommend when you do like a gray smoky eye or any kind of smoky eye. You can use any color. You can use blues. You can use black. You can use anything you like. Anything you have at home, you can use yellow. I've done one with yellow, like on the lid, and then I did um, like a dark smoky in the crease. Um, you can use like the blues on the lid with um, a dark smoky effect. Greens you can use. I have a really pretty green by MAC. This one is called um, Humid. That is a really pretty color to work with, especially with a, like, a nice crease smoky eye. It's different. Like Everybody assumes like if you want to do smoky eye, you can do like a black. You don't have to do a black. You can do any color that you like as long as maybe it's dark or matte. That's what I definitely recommend. Um, but that's about it for this look. Um, I do want to share with you also the things that I picked up this weekend. Um, Bed Bath, I mean, I'm sorry, Bath and Body Works. I don't get those two confused. You have to excuse me. I went there this weekend and they were having a sale on some really, really cute. Sanitizers. Now, I use these all the time, especially when I'm at school cutting hair or working with people like clients. It's really good to show them that you're very clean and sanitized. Um, even let them do it as well, too. So I like to carry these little bottles around. These are really cute. This one is um, Cupcake Blue Chicken. And it has, like, tiny, tiny sparkles on them. But they don't even show up on your skin, which is really good. Because you don't want, like, sparkle, like, all over the place. I have to use it now. I'm sorry. The one that I have, I got, like, a little keychain for it for my purse. I have their Halloween one. It's really cute, too. This one is, um, red velvet. This has, like, a sense of chocolate in it. It's so good. So I have this one first on my keychain because this one has to be one of my favorites. But these were 5 for $5. That's not bad. I also got um, a Santa Mellow Mint. This smells so good too. This one is like marshmallow with like a hint of mint in it. And it really like sanitizes. It has like the little sanitized beads in it. This one does too. This is Twisted Peppermint. I have the, um, the plug-in outlet for this too in my room right now. And it's really weird because like the peppermint itself actually like opens your like your um your sense. Like if you have a clogged nose or whatever, if you're sick, 
Like it helps your breathing. It's really weird, but this smells so good too. I love that. And then the last one I got was strawberry cupcake, and this has sparkles in it too. I think it's so cute. But like once you put it on your hands, you really don't even see it anymore. It's weird. It's so yummy. So these are little things I got. I got a plug in for my room. I have to get a new one because the one that I have broke. But that is the peppermint one. It has like peppermint swirls on it. Oh, it smells so good. I absolutely love it. But that was mainly it for my um, look today and my little haul. Um, I hope everybody had a really nice weekend. I did. I'm looking forward to the week. It's going to be my two year anniversary tomorrow. So I'm going to be getting um, a gift from my boyfriend. I got him gifts as well. So stay tuned to see what I got. I will post everything. And everybody have a really nice week. Bye.